Um, so what my research group is really interested in is the effects of reforestation on soil carbon. So we all know that trees are good at capturing carbon, but there's actually more carbon in the soils than in plants and the atmosphere combined. And the source of the carbon in the soil is ultimately dead plants. So when the trees die, they are decomposed and some of that carbon becomes part of the soil. And so what we're hoping to accomplish with this experiment is to understand how reforestation affects the accumulation of carbon in the soil over long time periods, how the species that we plant affect this process, um, and how the microbes that live in the soil in association with the trees affect the ability of soils to capture carbon over long time scales. So one of the really unique and amazing opportunities that's presented by this experiment specifically is its scale. Uh, so Plant for the Planet is able to plant and maintain uh, trees uh, in a huge area. So this experiment that we're putting in today is going to be almost 20 hectares in total, which offers us a lot of opportunity to try some really innovative treatments that will both enhance the health of the trees and hopefully have impacts on soil carbon sequestration in the long term. So a couple of the things that we're trying here is we are uh, testing different combinations of species, uh, especially including legumes, which fix nitrogen. And we expect that to affect soil carbon sequestration in specific ways. Because of the size of the experiment and our ability to sample over long periods of time, that's going to give us a really unprecedentedly detailed look at how uh, the presence of legumes in these growing forests is going to affect carbon capture. We're also trying something really novel in that we are going to inoculate these trees with microbes from a existing forest. Uh, and we expect this to affect the growth and survival of the trees. But what that also allows us to test over long time scales and over a lot of space is how bringing in microbes from a, another target ecosystem is going to affect the microbial communities here and their roles in soil carbon sequestration over the long term. Plant for the Planet has put together such an amazing team of people here, and there are so many amazing opportunities to ask both fundamental and applied questions about tropical forest ecology at this site. So the Waring Lab is always looking for people who are really passionate about tropical ecology, ecosystem ecology, or biogeochemistry, who want to take advantage of the experiments that are ongoing here. So please join us.